keep it nice and clean Not freak out and cause a scene I try to hold it together Keep it together Not sure who I really am Hello friends, it's Caitlin. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, be sure to take a pause and hit that subscribe button before you leave so that you don't miss out on any future videos. Today we are doing a Zara haul, which I'm pretty bummed about because I've never done a fully dedicated Zara haul video. I've definitely hauled a couple of Zara pieces in previous collective hauls, but never a fully dedicated video. So I'm pretty pumped about it. At the end of this video, I am going to include a couple of other things that I have gotten recently, but there was just not enough of them to do a whole nother video. So I'm just gonna include them in this one, but this is also going to be a try on because I personally appreciate try on. So that's why we're gonna do a try on. But if you wanna see this Zara haul, then just keep on watching. Okay, let's see what we've got in here. Beautiful. This is packaged so perfectly. Look at it. So let's go through this first box. The first thing I pulled out is this gorgeous dress. It is black with like white and red detailing it's kind of like a floral pattern but it's very subtle i love this it's kind of got a little bit of ruffled detailing on the front and then a ruffled hem which i really really love it also has a nice little button detail on the front portion of it but i think this is perfect for this type of weather like when we're in this transition period between winter and spring because you can wear this with some cute over the knee boots but you can also transition it into spring with some like sandals so i really like this i think it's so cute so we're just gonna see how it fits and see what it looks like on <laughs> this is what the dress looks like on i think it's very fun and flirty and really cute um it is a little wide but i think that's how it's supposed to look i just paired it with my chanel sandals for a more like spring look but like I said, you could pair it with over the knee boots to wear right now. But I do think I like it though. The next thing is a romper. I absolutely love rompers. It's another floral pattern, but this one is red with like more, I think it looks like kind of like a daisy, but I think this is super cute. It kind of has a like uh, ruche detailing in the back. Um, but I really like this. I think it's cute. We'll see how it fits. I'm very particular about rompers. I don't like them to be too short. So we'll see how long this one is on me. But so far, like just looking at it, I think it's really cute. It's more, it's like a satiny material, which is kind of nice. So it's a little bit more dressy. But again, this is another perfect transition piece from winter to spring because this would look really cute with some gray or black over the knee boots. And... I don't know, I just really love this. It's super cute. Okay, so this is what the romper looks like. I think it's cute. Um, I like the color and it is actually long enough, which is really nice. I paired it with my over the knee boots. It's got pockets. I don't know if I'm like in love with it. Um, it fits, it's a little big up top just because that's just what life is. <laughs> but I do think it's cute. And I think if you're looking for a really fun, easy romper, then this would definitely be a good option. The next thing I got is just a simple tank and it's kind of like a cropped, it's this really pretty like blush pink and I don't know what kind of material it is. It's kind of like stretchy, but I don't know. It has a scalloped kind of detail on the top and the bottom, which I really like, but I don't know. There's something about this is it's really cute i think this would be perfect now like layering but you could also obviously wear this in the spring and summer by itself but i don't know i think it's really cute we'll see how it actually fits on because it does look a little wide but maybe it fits differently okay so i absolutely 150 percent love this top i think it's so cute and so flattering this is something that i could wear literally all the time and i could wear it with like a sweater or cardigan over top of it, but I would also wear it by itself like in the spring and summer when it gets a little bit warmer. The next thing I have is a skirt. So this is what it looks like. It kind of looks a little short, so I'm a little worried, 
but it's this like quilted pattern and it is so cute and it has like a satiny feel to it but I really like it I am worried about how long it'll be on I think I went with a small which is usually normal for me but like how cute would this be with the shirt that I have on like I think that would be adorable like mixed prints graphic tee and a fun print but we'll see what it looks like on one of my favorite skirts I've ever purchased ever is from Zara so I really do love Zara skirts it's just sizing is always hit or miss for me because just not proportional <laughs> so we'll see what this looks like on but just looking at it I really really love it so I hope it's long enough the skirt is slightly too big and that's so sad because it's the cutest thing ever I definitely could get it altered like taken in on the sides so that it, it fits a little bit better if I wanted to but I do really like it it's shorter so be aware that it is a shorter skirt but I do think it's really really cute and this will go with so many different things so just gotta decide if it's worth altering <laughs> I think this next thing is one of my favorite things that I got because it's very like fun but I also kind of have a shirt similar to this but I don't have it exactly and it's this it is a like button down top that has these like black buttons and then it has the bow at the top which I really really love but it's polka dot and it's kind of see-through so we'll see what it looks like on like what type of top I would need to wear underneath it but you can see that the sleeves are sheer and I really love this I think this is so cute okay so this is what this top looks like it's clearly sheer you can see like my bralette I have and it's very sheer in the back I do like it but I already have like a top that looks really similar to this that I think I like a little bit more but I do think this is really really cute like this is very like chic so if you're looking for a top that has like a very chic vibe to it, then I would highly recommend. The last thing I have in this box is a dress and this is what it looks like. It is black and white polka dot. It is a like midi length dress or at least it was midi length on the model, but it looks really long. So I have a feeling this might be full length on me. I am 5'5", five five, so I mean, I'm sure the model is like 5'10". But it's kind of like a little slip dress almost. It has this fun detail in the front where it kind of just scoops down. I am really loving dresses like this because I think that they're so sleek. But just really fun at the same time. And I think this is something that you could easily wear more casually. Like belt it and wear some sandals. But you could easily, easily dress this up with some fun black heels. And... I don't know where it out I don't know I just there's something about this that I really love and it's once again it's like a satiny material which I think dresses it up a lot this is the polka dot dress I think it's really cute it is very slimming when you look to the side I really love that the neckline is fun and the length is actually midi like I thought it was gonna be really long but it actually fits pretty well so I think it's super cute definitely if you have a more formal occasion this would be great but again I do think you could belt it and wear like sandals and you could just wear this in the summertime I love it moving on to box number two gotta open it first like I said I got a lot of things I think I said that did I say that I got a lot of things I've never gotten this much from Zara at once before so this is definitely new for me but I've also never ordered online from Zara because sizing is always very odd oh wait correction I have ordered one thing online from Zara but that is it and that is because I never know what size I'm going to be so but here is to box number two and this is what this one looks like it's cute. I love this color so far. This is something I'm really, really pumped about. And it are, and it is these pants. So they're a high-waisted, like, 
flare pant with this like nice pleat in the front and they're like a mustardy yellow color like once again it would look really cute with this graphic t-shirt <laughs> but I really love this I mean I really hope these fit I got a small and I hope they fit I hope they look kind of short which is surprising because um I'm not sure tall but they do look kind of short so we'll see how they fit but oh my goodness I really hope that these fit me well because they're so cute well unfortunately there is um a little bit of room here <laughs> but I love these pants like I mean if I hold the front like they are like the world's most flattering pants I've ever put on my body I think that they are amazing. So maybe the extra small would fit. Obviously I could alter the small but I've had things altered in the past that are pants and especially when there's pockets on the back it's always a little bit harder. So I think I should just get the extra small because I mean these pants are like oh my goodness like the best pants I've ever put on. I love them. And they're this, like, perfect yellow color. Like, how could I, like, not keep these? But, like, get the right size. Because I don't think that's going to work. But I do love this. Next is this. Oh, yeah, this is a skirt. And I thought it was a very interesting. It's kind of different. But, I don't know, there's just something about it that is just kind of fun. So, it is this fun, like... I don't know what you would call this pattern actually um but it has a you'll be able to see it better in the try on it has a shorter skirt that ends right here and then it has like a little opening so you can see that so I'm interested to see how this fits and what it looks like on but just looking at it I think it could be really cute so we'll see okay so this is what this one looks like you can see that it has the little short part here and it's just very fun, it's very flowy, it's different. I don't own anything like this, so I think that's why I kind of really like it. But it also has a lot of print to it and a lot of color, which means it can be paired with a lot of different tops, which I greatly appreciate. I got something else in that same print because I just kind of really like it. And it is just this simple, like, button-up. Obvious, I probably wouldn't button it all the way up. But it is a long sleeve, just cute little button up and it's the same print and I really like it. I probably wouldn't pair them together, but you definitely could. I think this could look really cute with those like mustard pants, but obviously this would be cute with like jeans or anything like that as well or like a skirt. But I'm interested to see what this looks like on because I've been seeing this style print a lot of different places. I think it's called like a... That was thunder. Um, I think it's called like a... It's gonna stop eventually. I think it's called like a scarf print. I think that's kind of the trend. That's the spring 2019 trend. Okay, so this is what the shirt looks like. This is what it looks like untucked. It's obviously the same print as the skirt. But I personally like my shirts tucked in. Obviously, you can wear it a little bit more open like this. But I do like it. And I think it's really cute. But it reminds me too much of this top that I have. Like, obviously, they're completely different prints. But they're both, like, printed tops. And I just don't see myself wearing this. Especially because I like the skirt more. And then this is the last thing that I have from Zara, which I think is super cute. And it is just this top. And it's kind of like an off-the-shoulder top. And it's like ruched. And it's just black with all these different color florals. It looks, at least on the model, it looks a lot better on than it looks just like this. So obviously you will see what it looks like on the try on, but it is, it does zip up the back, which is really nice. And I think it, it unzips all the way. So I don't know. I'm really pumped to see what this actually looks like on. Cause I do think it's really cute. And again, I think it would be really cute with the yellow pants, 
but you could also wear this with like red pants or green pants or pink pants or just simply with jeans like regular denim or white denim or black denim but I think this is really cute so that is everything from the Zara haul and now I'm going to show you the few things that I have gotten recently that I just want to share with you guys so stay tuned for that okay the top is very tight I cannot move my arms above here but it is really cute and it's extremely flattering I really love it but I just don't think that it's very practical because I literally can't move my arms now that could be because I just got too small of a size I got the extra small and maybe I should have gotten the small but it is so cute for the random things, I have like five or six things here, but the first thing is this, and it is just this really cute um, candle holder that I got from Bath & Body. This is what it looks like without the candle in it, but it is super cute. You've got the arc there, and then you have the Eiffel Tower here, and then obviously I put a candle in here, and I love this. I've never seen a candle holder from Bath & Body that I really liked and then I saw this and I obviously had to get it because it works perfectly in my room so I absolutely love this and a scent I've been loving recently is I got this a while ago but it's the in the stars scent and I have this in the candle but I also have this in the body wash and body lotion because I just love how it smells it says it is I'll tell you what it says. Bergamot Champagne Night Blooming Water Lily Pink Salted Amber. Those are the fragrance notes. So, <laughs> I don't know. I do really like this and I think that it looks perfect in my closet. The next three things that I got are all from Anthropology. The first one being this cup, which is just like a normal... Let's see, it's probably not going to focus. I don't know if it's going to focus. Oh, there we go. You can kind of see it. And it is just a New York cup. And it has, like, Washington Square Park, the Empire State Building, the Statue of Liberty, Brooklyn Bridge. Like, all these cute little things. There's a taxi on it. But I'm actually using this as a little pen holder so I think it's really cute and it just sits on my desk and I really love it so that is one of my anthropology finds next is another headband so I have been obsessed with headbands I really like the ones that are knotted at the top like this and this is kind of just like a burg it's coming off really red in camera but it's more of like a burgundy color and I just love them. I think they're really cute. I have this same exact headband in a mustard yellow color, but I also really like this one. Last but not least from Anthropology is this, and it is this fun jacket, which I love. I don't have a puffer jacket, and I think this one's super cute. It's like a floral, and oh, it's very much like my aesthetic. Like, there was a jacket there was a puffer jacket that's supposed to be me. This is definitely it. And I'm pretty pumped about it. So look forward to pictures in this in the future because it's pretty cute. <laughs> the last new in item I have to talk to you about today is none other than Camo and Jamo merch. So I'm going to roll a little clip of are six different styles so there is the bonjour new york one there is the fashion weeks one which is the one that i have on there is the take me to paris one which is in french there's obviously camo and jmo and then there's hello friends and then coffee and champagne i'm so excited about them so be sure to follow the link in the description box down below to purchase your own it's just camo and jmo.com backslash merch so i'm really pumped i hope you guys like them I think that the um, Fashion Weeks one is my personal favorite, but I love all of them, obviously. <laughs> but I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, and I will see you next time. Bye! One, two, K.
keep it nice and clean Not freak out and cause a scene I try to hold it together Keep it together Not sure who I really am Just be cute and super